speaking of creating I'll our refer. narratives, we had an announcement this week that Peacock has yeah. 18 total million subscribers. Woo! They grew and I'm gonna from take, 15 to 18, hey, 3 million. We're going to create our own narratives around this, okay. but I'm going to take the positive <laughs> on this. Peacock now has 18,000 thousand subscribers. That sounds cool. Yeah. Really cool. 18 million <laughs> is such a huge number that yes. it's unimaginable. Kyle, think in your head. Try to imagine 18 million of something. Mm-hmm. Physical items, mm-hmm. 18 million of them. Try to think about it. Mm-hmm. Can't do it, can you? It's a little hard. Yeah. I'm see, losing space. It's so many subscribers. My brain can only hold so many numbers. And they're... And they're <laughs> Introductory prices of one ninety nine a month is so affordable. <laughs> like, what? What? Streaming's weird, man. How do they think this is a good thing? Streaming's weird. I, hit I us, go, hit us with the real facts go, here. No, I go back and forth with this because while it is a growth in their subscriber base, they still Big are numbers. trying to prop up this floundering streaming service with movie content so so universal has is the only studio that really in 2022 that did day and dating so what they did it with firestarter and uh, honk for jesus and honk for jesus and some halloween other, halloween halloween God, that yeah. was this year okay yeah so they're the only ones doing this and it's still not helping their 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 streaming out so i just I'm just so over them, and they and they want to really shut those windows down to the three weeks to get it back on Peacock, and it's just you're just cutting your nose to spite the face here on this. It's now, just... I will also say for Peacock that HBO is kind of going through something right now. They're cutting uh, jobs. They're cutting shows. Some shows are just being taken off the streaming service and no one knows where they are now (laughs) yes that's true that could mean that people get off of streaming and then that 18 million goes to 19 20 million (laughs) they could pick up a few from the from the i mean 19.2 19.4 million thousands and thousands (laughs) yeah tens of people will be signing up for your streaming service but that's why streaming is so weird it's like why are we bothering to do this stuff if Nothing seems to be all, working. All it's doing is like, the, I think Green everybody, chaos. yeah, I think everybody forgets the reason why streaming was awesome and you could cut cord is because there was one service, Netflix mm-hmm. before, and maybe Prime, one, but essentially one service, and it had everything on it. So you went from your TV menu that had everything, but you were paying $150 a month to Netflix where you could pay $15 a month. And still have it for the most part, everything on it. Yeah. And now, the you know the five You're, ten years later, we're at this point where it's like, oh, I only have a fraction of what I've got, and then to get everything I wanted, I had to add all these things. Yeah. I have cable back again. You're, I have cable costs again. Yeah, you're and forced it's just to have over s- half over a dozen it. streaming services. Oh my gosh. <laughs> To, to cover what you need. I will just buy the <laughs> box set of The Office and keep the DVDs and then save myself. Speaking of Peacock's only real offering. <laughs> <laughs> How many months of Peacock will it take me to to pay for like one? Well, it's only $2 set. a month if you got in at the introductory so, price. So it would take you to buy anything other than a hot dog at Costco. It will take multiple months. <laughs> <laughs> it was, it's so incredibly cheap. It makes it seem worthless. Right. <laughs> that is true. But now they're, now they're going to these paid tiers. I will never pay for commercials. I hated commercials on TV. I yeah. would rather just watch DVDs <laughs> and go way old school. Cody than wants to have deliver, deliver Netflix again. I will never live in a world. <laughs> Let I me got talk out to my mailman it. again. Yeah. I got, for out, God's sake. I got out of <laughs> commercials. And I, that's the only reason I went to streaming. I was like ad free. I could just binge. This is wonderful. It's cheap. It's only now, one place. And now I have to wait um, weekly for stuff. I am getting, I get before my garbage TV show, Did Your Sister Wives, I get four minutes of ads that play before. I am I cannot wait till that this last season is over so I can just yank Hulu and just not go back to it anymore. Yeah. I have four minutes of waste of my life every time I want to watch a sister wife. 